What's going on, Kyle here? It's been a while since I uh, made a video, Christmas holidays and everything going on, but uh, things have calmed down now. So I figured I'd uh, get right back into it. I've been uh, seeing a lot of videos lately with people uh, doing reviews on the new BCW Prime X4 carrying case that comes out uh, later in February. And I figured um, with all these reviews coming out, I figured I would show you what I use to carry around my, my decks when I, go to, when I go out to play. And uh, I cannot take uh, full credit for this solution. I was actually on Facebook in the uh, Transformers group back in December and one of the users there uh, posted what he uses. I saw the idea and I decided to copy it. So um, the user there was Damian Mayfield. I'm gonna give credit where credit is due here. Um, and so as you can see, here's his, his masterpiece here. He's using the uh, Dex carrying case and he's added Velcro strips for his character cards, for a trade binder, and for the Titan cards. I'll get into, I'll show you mine, what I've done. I've uh, copied him with the Velcro, but I have not gone as far. I've only done the one, only because I found if you try to put the binder up here, you can't have as many decks. I want to carry on more decks because decks are too high for the binder. So that's credit where credit is due. Um, giving uh, Damien a shout out here. Gave me the idea. I followed along with it. And so let's get uh, uh, right into it. Uh, first off, I want to let you know I am not sponsored by Dex in any way. They did not provide this product to me. I did not reach out to them in any way. This is just what I use. I'm actually a big fan of Dex products. Um, I use all their binders for my Magic cards, for my Transformers cards, everything. Um, so this is the product here. It is the uh, Dex Protection Carrying Case. comes in a number of colors. Uh, I went with red and black. Just things just looks the best. Uh, it's got a hard case. Um, it's got suede, like a red suede uh, liner. And uh, I'll pull it up here for you. So this here is the case. It's got a handle. Carrying around with the handle. It's got straps on the side. Uh, not straps, little hooks on each side here. Uh, you can use those hooks with the provided strap. I don't carry around the strap, but if you're someone who wants to carry it on your shoulder with a strap, uh, so be it. You can use that. Again, see I'm moving the case around just to show you that I have my stuff inside. I'm not too worried about it getting damaged. It's pretty pretty solid on the outside here. It's got a zipper to open up. So open the zipper. Open her up. And as you can see right now, I've got my playmat from Energy Invitational. It comes with a dice box. I've got uh, 12 dice and I'll show you that in a second. I've got one, two, three, four decks. Got a bunch of the smaller character cards here in top loaders. And I have got my character cards here uh, strapped down with the Velcro. Uh, so you see, I put Velcro in, so you can open it up, take the, take the characters out. What I also did was with the Velcro, I attached it to the bottom. You can see there's a line of Velcro there. Velcro on the bottom. I'll go through what what materials I used here. It's basically elastic and um, fabric Velcro. And this way, you can see right here, I've got probably about 12 character cards. And these are in the larger top loaders. These are in the Ultra Pro, uh, the Ultra Pro three and a half by five and one eighth top loaders. Uh, I cannot get the BCW top loaders here. Uh, everybody I've asked to order them can't do it, the smaller three and a half by five. So these are the ones that I have to use. They're a bit bigger, and I don't know if you've seen some of the videos, when people put these into the BCW case, they gotta sit on an angle. They don't go flat, only the smaller BCW ones go in flat. Here, as you can see, these fit perfectly in there. With the Velcro, I put it upside down. Whoops, I lost the deck there, but they're not gonna fall out. They're not gonna move around as you are I'm going to pick that up as you're using it. So again, four decks, um, a bunch of character cards. You could go even more with the Velcro and the elastic. I'll show you what I use here now. Let's just get the top loader off the screen here. So for Velcro, I picked up, um, I went into Michael's, I went to Walmart, both had this. Uh, it's Velcro, uh, sticky back for fabrics. I guess you could go with Velcro uh, that you can sew on or glue on, but I figured the sticky back, I'm not very crafty. Uh, this was my easiest easiest way and it is three quarter inch wide that way it'll fit inside the elastic the elastic that i was using that i bought 
It's not this exact brand. I couldn't find a picture of it. I'd already used it up, but it was one inch non-roll elastic. And that way, if it's one inch, it's wider than the Velcro. The Velcro can go right in the middle of it, not overlap and hold everything in place. All in all, I'm very happy with this, as you saw. Once I close it up, nothing's going anywhere. I mix it all up. And when I reopen it, everything is right where it should be. Uh, so for the dice case, right now, it holds 12 dice. It may hold more, but I haven't actually tried to see if I can get another layer in there. Can't really see the dice because they are green and I'm in front of a green screen. But basically, it's holding 12 of the larger size dice. I'm sure it could hold more of the smaller dice. But that's more than enough for your Transformers games. It's got a zipper pouch on it. I'll zip it back up. And it goes right back in the slot there. And as you see, the playmat can come out. Spot for the playmat. I guess if you don't want to put a playmat in there, you could probably put some other things in there. But I like a spot for this big energy on playmat. Close it up. I think I, I got this pre-order for me. I think it was around $50 Canadian. So I'm guessing it'd probably be somewhere around $40, $35, $40 US. But once again, this is the Dex Protection, Dex Carrying Case. I approve. As I said, I use a lot of Dex products. Um, I wasn't given anything to do this, but this is just what I use. So if you want to have different options, I think this one looks a lot sleeker. And uh, it's pretty cool. All right. Hope you all enjoyed. If you have any questions, uh, please put them in the comments section. Once again, I, I normally, I said in the beginning, I normally used to call myself Ventric, but that was my Call of Duty name. So this is Transformers. I'm going to go by my real, my real name. It's Kyle. So hope you guys enjoyed. Until next time, be safe and have fun.